Hey, hey, it's Shay Shay. Welcome back to my channel, guys. And if you're new, welcome to my channel. So you guys, this is gonna be my collection review on Victoria's Secret New New. I finally got my hands on all of the new scents in this line. This is their Natural Beauty Body Care line, and they did have this out last year in 2020. However, they brought out two new scents, and we'll get into that. So yeah, I'm really happy I got my hands on this stuff, and let's get right into the review. And also, real quick, thank you to the person and other people who requested me to do this video. So I did get my hands on them, like I said. So yeah, the first one we're gonna get into, which I think we should just start off with the new ones. So guys, also like I said that this line has been out before and they did add two new ones. So the first new one that they added was lavender and vanilla and the second one was cucumber and green tea. I also noticed that for the semi-annual sale and in the sale part of their website, they actually put one of the scents in this collection on for sale. I'm not sure why, but they put the green pear and citrus on sale and it was available for SAS. I don't know why they did that. I don't know why they took this one out of the line, but they replaced it with this new one, cucumber and green tea. They're both green liquids. They both had the exact same bottle, but two different scents. And they both say refresh on there. So if you guys notice that, please let me know if you know anything about it. I don't know why they took out the green pear and citrus. Actually, a lot of people like this one, as do I as well. I like this one. And then they put the cucumber and green tea as the refresh mist on there. I don't know, but I did notice it, but I'm happy because I have them both. So that's really cool. They both look exactly alike, as you can see, but they have different names and scents, so I don't know. So the older one, Green Pear and Citrus, this one says hit refresh with the scent of Green Pear and Citrus, Botanical Inspiration, Pure Invigoration, and Cucumber and Green Tea says refresh with the scent of Cucumber and Green Tea, Botanical Inspiration, Pure Invigoration. I don't know why they switched them, but let's get right into the scent. So the new one, cucumber and green tea. This is nice, I do smell cucumbers and green tea. And I'm not really a big fan of cucumbers. Like I was kind of like hesitant to try this one because I don't like cucumber melon. I don't like the Dove Go Fresh cucumber smell. I just don't like cucumbers and they don't do good with my body chemistry personally. This is nice. You definitely equally, again, get the cucumber and the green tea. I think this like collection's kind of spa-like in a way, so maybe that might be why they call it natural because these aren't natural. The bottles look simple and the ingredients maybe look cleaner, but it's all like fragrance. It's not natural, so I don't know why they put it as a natural beauty body care line. Bonnie said something similar to that in her video, and I would agree. I don't know why this is called the natural body care, but I mean, I guess. These are all kind of light in a way as well, and they all probably last up to six hours, eight if you're lucky. But yeah, most of the body mist lasts up to six to eight hours for me. Rarely do I find that one lasts longer, but that is why you mainly hear me say that they last from like two to eight hours. So yeah, these I would say are two to six hours of wear on them. This smells a little perfumey to me in a way, so it's like a perfumey, like spa-like, cucumber green tea smell. It's not my favorite, but it is nice. To be honest, I kind of feel more refreshed with this green pear and citrus more than this cucumber green tea. But let's get into this one real quick, even though this one's no longer in the collection. So this is the one that cucumber and green tea replaced. This is green pear and citrus. I like this one a lot better than the cucumber one. I don't know why they changed it. I prefer this one to be honest with you guys. Again, you smell the green pear and citrus very equally in this spray, but it smells a little warm and a little bit sweet to me. This is super refreshing and what I would want my spa experience to smell like. And on my skin, I mainly get the citrus, so it's a very fruity, citrusy, clean, refreshing, like spa-like scent. 
it doesn't last long it's like two to six hours of wear on this one but it does smell really really good and again i do like it better than the cucumber and green tea spray that they replaced it with i don't get it but yeah this one smells really really good and i get like a little bit of lemons on my skin now this one is refreshing I'm not sure if you can get your hands on this. I don't see it anymore on the website. You may find it in a store or an outlet, but as of now, when I recently checked, it's not on the website. So yeah, I guess they just stopped making this one. I wish I would've got two of them and I was going to. I would just focus on other things during SAS, but I wish I would've got at least two or three because this is really nice. Okay, the second new one that everybody's talking about is this lavender and vanilla relax version. That is good. I really like that a lot. This lavender and vanilla, you guys, my verdict on this is that it is so, so good. I thought this would remind me of the lavender vanilla that is very popular on Bath & Body Works, if you did not know, in their aromatherapy line. Every time I check on the website or there's a body care sale or a body butter moisturizer sale, it's always sold out in the lavender vanilla scent on Bath & Body Works. I think it's still sold out now. If you go online, I think the lavender and vanilla like pillow mist spray is actually sold out currently. But here is the lavender and vanilla by Victoria's Secret, which they're owned by the same company. So I thought that they were gonna smell the same and they have a little bit, like a little hint of the same essence. But you guys know how, okay, follow me here so you guys know how on bath and body works it says lavender and vanilla but it doesn't smell like that for the lavender vanilla set on bath and body works right to me and this might just be me but i smell baby powder complete strong baby powder on the lavender and vanilla set on bbw but with this lavender and vanilla on victoria's secret this is what the name says can you guys believe it this smells like lavender and vanilla and it has a little bit of muskiness to it in my opinion and it has like a little bit of warm sweetness so this is what i would picture lavender and vanilla to smell like and i really like this this does actually surprisingly really good on my skin it smells a little bit perfumey i think honestly to be honest this is the most long lasting one on my skin i would say i do get up to a good six hours maybe even it's like seven this one smells super good i had it on my skin for a while and it smells just amazing this sweet lavender vanilla a little bit musky scent so if you want more of a baby powder scent i would suggest you go to Bath & Body Works. That one's like calming baby powder in the lavender and vanilla scent. And if you literally want lavender and vanilla, a sweet, a little bit earthy scent, I would suggest you go for the Victoria's Secret version. I kind of think that lavender and vanilla lasts a little bit longer with Bath & Body Works, but this one is also a nice contender. You guys, I actually want a few bottles of this because it's that good. Like, I love the lavender and vanilla on Bath & Body Works. Let me just say that right now. But I like this one too. So I have my baby powder scent and then I have my lavender and vanilla actual scent. So I think that's awesome. And I also really wanted that scent in a spray. So now I have it now. I cannot wait to pair the both of these together. And you guys know I normally do not pair my scents with lotions only because like I don't like the consistency of Victoria's Secret lotions. And sometimes like even Bath & Body Works, like I prefer basically other lotions to the Bath & Body Works or Victoria's Secret brand. However, when a scent is really good, I have to pair it up. So with that being said, I did get the lavender and vanilla body lotion to pair with the mist. And this is really cool because this says it is a 24 hour moisturizer. I am so not sure how true that is. Um, you know, these tend to be watery and not that like moisturizing, but I'm gonna test it out. The next one in this collection is Coconut Milk and Rose. Now, I skipped on this one because I don't like coconut milk and I don't like floral scents, so I didn't get it when it first came out. However, when there was a sale, I think it was the $6.95 sale, I did purchase it and I actually like the scent. On my skin, it's okay. It kind of changes on my skin, but I do like the scent in the bottle. And this is supposed to calm you, it says. 
with this one i do think it smells very pretty but again it changes on my skin to this kind of weird scent in my opinion and that's just my body chemistry so i'm getting like a creamy like coconut milk scent with definitely some floral roses in there it's very warm it's a little bit perfumey and i'm getting again like that milky creamy scent so it's kind of not like gourmand at all but like sweet a little bit if that makes sense this one is nice if you really do like florals and that warm coconut creamy scent i think you would like this one a lot and the last scent in this collection, which is number five, even though there's only four available right now in the collection, this is pomegranate and lotus and it's supposed to give you balance. Pomegranate and Lotus is a very fruity floral. When I first spray it, I get mainly that pomegranate and then I do get that Lotus like right behind it. I'm not a big floral person and I do have um, specific florals that I do go for if I would even ever go for florals, which I normally don't unless they're mixed with something good. Like really fruity florals or sweet florals maybe. Pomegranate, I love the smell of pomegranate. I like the pomegranate fruit to eat. However, I find that in fragrances, pomegranate, even though it smells good, it's just kind of light and not long lasting. In my opinion, I found like even midnight pomegranate. And lotus doesn't do that great on my skin either. So this scent also turns, like I said, unfortunately on my skin. It doesn't smell like how it does in the bottle on me. But I mean, that's okay. I know that scents tend to change when they go on your skin skin it's all about body chemistry so yeah but to me it does smell like a perfumey pomegranate floral lotus smell so if you guys like that i genuinely think you will like this one and yeah guys so those are the five scents i have in this collection that i reviewed for you guys okay so my favorite two that smell the best to me and do the best on my skin would have to be these two and this is green pear and citrus which it's not available anymore that kind of sucks. And then the other one, which is a new one, lavender and vanilla. I like these two the best and they last the longest on my skin and they smell the best in my opinion. And even though these all do smell good, I do have to pick a least favorite and it's definitely these three, mainly because I do like them in the bottles but on my skin, they kind of change to a weird scent that I just am not crazy over. So yeah. So this one's cucumber and green tea, coconut milk and rose, and pomegranate and lotus. My least favorites. And all right guys, that's the end of my video. Let's get right into my quote. If anyone can do something in life, why can't you? If Beyonce could do it, or your friend can do it, or someone you knew of in high school can go for their dreams and make money and just do well for themselves, why can't you? What's stopping you? The answer is you can do it, you guys. You can do whatever you put your mind to in life as long as you put effort behind it and you have faith in Jesus Christ. I believe in the Lord, can't say it enough. I believe in prayer, I do believe prayer works. I have many testimonies. And in the Bible, it also says something along the lines of, ask him and pray about it and you shall receive it. You gotta keep asking, you gotta keep having faith and you have to keep believing that what's meant for you will always be just for you, okay? Anyone I feel like can go do whatever they want to in life as long as they put effort behind it and they just try. Some more encouraging things I want you guys to know is that, say it with me, you are important, you have value, and your life has meaning. Never forget that, don't let any negativity get in your head, don't let anyone tell you otherwise. You're meant to be here and you are important, okay? And we need all positivity in 2020 going forward. I like to say these positive words of encouragement and this positive message to get to people because I want to uplift people. We need more of that going on in the world, you know? More peace and positivity and just happiness. Life is so short, you just wanna just make the best of it and you just gotta think about that sometimes. And mental health is real that's why I want to let you guys know that you matter and you're supposed to be here never give up on yourself and don't let anyone ever try to make you give up on you you know I feel like everybody has a purpose we're all meant to be here for a reason and I genuinely believe that and I just wanted to leave on that note for you guys whoever needed this message I hope it reached you thank you so much for watching my videos and supporting me and subscribing and don't forget 
to like, comment, and subscribe. Don't forget to comment because how will I know that you watch my video if you don't comment, you know? I love chatting with you guys. I try to get to everyone as best I can. And again, I'm so happy to review this collection. I told you guys I got y'all. I really do. I finally got my hands, by the grace of God, on all these new collections. So stay tuned because I will be reviewing a lot more on Bath & Body Works and Victoria's Secret. So stay tuned. And on that note, I will see you guys in the next video. Bye, guys. Be blessed.